move there that she was making. I think she was about four wider on the last turn. Having the two hole much better than the nine hole, I do look for high performance to finish well and actually win the race nine. Second, the three, Dorth Dana. Third, the seven, Icons Falcon. I took two, three, seven, high performance in the ninth race. Then to the tenth race, race ten, first half of the late double. In the tenth race, I took the four, Keystone Edna. Keystone Edna comes out of the red hot Danny Collins barn. As you see, he's training a 540. This horse has really been racing very good. You can see she's been second, third, first, third, second, first. Really been really lighting them up and finishing well. Last two times she's drawn post seven. She gets the four hole tonight. I think she can win. Second the one, it's two of a kind. Third the two, Cameo Peanut Bond. I took four one two Keystone Edna in the tenth. Then on to the eleventh race, the eleventh and final live race on the night's card. Scratch the seven arm bro wonder. I took the six midway dotty. This horse is dropping down in class coming to us from the Meadows. The last time that she was here, she had post eight in better condition company, going for $2,700. Finished fifth, only beaten two lengths. A drop down in class. I think she's got a lot of good gate speed, too. She'll set herself well up early. I do look for Midway Dotty to be home a winner. Sack on the two, Pretty Pacific. Third, the three, Maxis Noble Lady. Rounding out the super, then the nine, Raps Delight. I took six, two, three, nine, Midway Dotty in the 11th and final. And those are the picks as I see them here tonight. Don't forget, post time at 7.35. Also, join us tomorrow. Great stakes action here at Cider Downs. I believe we have 10 divisions of Ohio Sire Stakes tomorrow, each of those going for $20,000. Bet early, bet often. Good luck.